a pro wrestling doc beloved by those who get it, completely baffling to those who don't. Whilst North America and the WWE has clearly dominated the landscape of wrestling for eons, providing us with global stars like The Rock and Stone Cold Steve Austin, the sport and spectacle of pro grappling extends far beyond Vince McMahon's paws. And today marks the long-awaited arrival of the easily the globe's second biggest wrestling event, Wrestle Kingdom in Japan. By and large there are three core types of pro wrestling in the world, presenting three different core types of storytelling. There's North American WWE-style wrestling, which treats the sport more like a soap opera. There's Mexican-style Lucha Libre, which treats it all more like a comic book. And then there's Japanese Puresu and Strong-style wrestling, in which competitors simply kick the living piss out of each other for real. The largest wrestling promotion in Japan is New Japan Pro Wrestling, and today they present Wrestle Kingdom 12, their annual January 4th show from the 55,000-seat Tokyo Dome that is second only to WrestleMania in terms of size and scale. Thanks to a bumper year for NJPW, the show tonight is virtually guaranteed to whip significant s. But for the casual, or non-fan it might be a little much to take in .but here's a quick couple of bullet, club, points as to what's going down tonight, and why it's going to own, Wrestle Kingdom 12's main event will see IWGP heavyweight champion Kazuchika Okada put his title on the line against challenger Tetsuya Naito. As champion, Okada has held the title for over 560 days, dating back to April 10, 2016 when he won the title off of Naito himself. Okada is clean-cut, athletic, handsome, and everything you'd expect a champion to be. Naito, on the other hand, is to this one's do-gooder attitude for a laid-back, couldn't-give-a-shit, anti-authority persona. At one point he was set to be the company's new big good guy, but fans rejected him. After returning from an excursion to Mexico, Naito formed Los Ingobernables to Japan and began a mission to tear down NJPW and everything the fans cared about. It's going to rule. Canadian Kenny Omega currently holds the IWGP United States Heavyweight Championship. He's the first person to hold the belt. But in his way stands global icon and first ballot Hall of Famer Chris Jericho. Frankly, it's bloody working a treat. J.A.Y. White is 25 years old, he is from Auckland, and he is absolutely gunning headfirst for Hiroshi Tanahashi, one of NJPW's most decorated veterans, and the current holder of the prestigious IWGP Intercontinental Championship. White is the next big thing in pro wrestling. After graduating from NJPW's fabled Young Lion program, White has spent the past two years on excursion throughout the US and Europe, returning to Japan in late 2017 as a fully fledged member of the NJPW roster, immediately targeting Tanahashi.
find somewhere showing it and go have yourself a Thursday. Trust me. It's going to absolutely rule.